He is four inches taller. He will have a three-inch reach advantage. All right, now with the official introductions, we go inside the octagon of Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in 152 pounds. Fighting out of Mumbai, India, Bam Bam. And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 14 wins, four losses. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Busan, South Korea. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. And with that touch of the gloves, we are underway. Ready? All right, let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. We've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is. And this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. There. If you're boxing this guy and only boxing him, you will be in trouble. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. 
Oh, and there's another leg kick for good measure. So doing a really good job with that weapon here tonight. And if you're trying to slow your opponent down, mission accomplished so far. When you can land that many leg kicks, you start to affect the movement. You start to affect the hands. Everything changes when you're blasting someone over and over and over with leg kicks. And you start to see the damage, not only in the legs, but in the facial expression right. of his opponent. Good punch, Lance. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? You wonder if the offensive fighter's gonna start to get frustrated here. Most stiff on all these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Big head kick. Real quick leg kick. And they separate. Big foul punch land. Now he gets back to range. The Korean Superboy gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Big leg kick lands. Oh, that's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. It'll probably feel something like that. It has to. This guy is landing his kick with so much force. Series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. He blocks the punch. Oh, huge Superman punch. Oh, single collar tie here. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Well, what a round it was, and how about that flying Superman punch at the end of the round? Not a lot of fighters will try it. He did, he executed. And it worked, right? No discouragement from his opponent to make him not try it. Why not try it? It's working, so why not try it again? If his opponent isn't careful, he will get knocked out and be on a highlight reel for the rest of the time. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are gonna really start to take their turn. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh, nice. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. The Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. That was a thudding leg kick. Wow, huge head kick. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Nice punch here. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. Straight right hand, no good. Single collar tie now. Get the turtle in that kick. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. That is when you have to be throwing more kicks. That's the only way to. His opponent in a lot of trouble now. That was Kane Velasquez's punch of choice. Every time he lands that overhand right, 
he hurt people bad. And this guy has his opponent hurt very badly again. That's a big strike right there. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Left punch is good. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Ten minutes in the books. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. All right, next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good back and forth action in the previous round. Yes, it wasn't a far fight. It wasn't two guys throwing the kitchen sink at each other. But you did see times when it came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Punch over the top. Nice leg kick land. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. How about that shin? Just misses there with the left. Oh, beautiful straight left hand. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by the Korean Superboy. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Straight right is there. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot. That's incoming. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he gonna do to follow up? Nice one, two there. Pretty strong jab there by Shore. Oh, a huge block there. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Great punch landed with so much power. Unable to connect with the right. Back and forth we go! There's no give on that leg kick. Huge block there. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Beautiful strike. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC. And if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, I mean, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. 
All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Nice kick right there. Tell the masses how how good that feels to get kicked like that. Johnny doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. But he needs to check one of these kicks. He has to discourage him from doing this kick over and over again. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Oh, and he caught the kick. Oh, big punch land. Some nice back and forth action here. Just over two minutes now to go. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Nice hammer fist. All right, so not enough action there on the ground. The referee brings the fight back to the feet, and we are back underway. Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Forty-five seconds remain in the round. Leg kick. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. And he landed the right hand there. Ooh. And there's the buzzer indicating the end of round four. All right, so a big knockdown in that last round, DC. We'll show you the replay. Nearly had him out of there. He almost had him out. He had him gone. He hurt him real bad. He thought the fight was over. But the night will go on. The dance continues. Will this be the final dance? You ready? You ready? We have arrived at this fifth and final round. Ooh, big shot lands. Punch is blocked. Oh, setting up the left hook, but out of range. Oh, that's an air DC. He massive, is hurt. Massive hook lands, and his opponent seems to be on his way out of the fight. Joy's got the tie clinch. Let's see what he can do. Misses with the left hook. Ooh, blocks the shot. the feet now. Misses again with a right punch. Nice punch, man. Jeez Louise. Under three minutes to decide this one. Oh! Oh, he might be in trouble here after that big diving punch. 
Nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do now. He's going to start looking to land big shots from the top. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. Oh, wow, that happened quickly as the fighter reverses position there on the ground. Unbelievable position change. Wow, what a transition. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. Right inside his opponent's guard here, DC. You don't want to play around here too long. No, you got to either have two hands in or two hands out. Our guys start to attack triangle. Oh, and he's back up again. Joy gets caught with that punch. All right, late in the fight now, Nishore. He's going to lose this fight tonight. We'll see if he goes for it. I mean, he's got to pull out all the stops. There is no more strategy. There is no more time to try to set up a punch. You got to just start letting everything fly. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. So the fight goes the distance as we await the judges' scorecards, but certainly a dominant striking effort out of that fighter tonight. John, he used his best weapons in order to carry him to a decision, a very clear decision, in my opinion. A great performance tonight by this young fighter. Decision now in, the buff has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 49-44. Going the winner by unanimous decision, the Korean Super Bowl, Du Ho so the judges are in agreement tonight. He is your winner by unanimous decision. Certainly a pretty easy fight to score, I thought. Yeah, I thought it was an easy fight to score.